Okay, I actually had to freeze some flies today, uh, so I figured I would make a video just kind of showing how to do it. It's not difficult, um, so I'll just do a quick demonstration of how to freeze flies. So, like, whenever you're taking flies out of the vial, you're just going to gas them carefully. Uh, if your vials are old, like minor, they might get kind of stuck to the uh, cotton ball. So the cotton ball gets kind of wet and sticky over time. So you just want to be aware of that. Tap out as many flies as you can. And then like if you're going to do anything else to them, you're just going to knock them all onto the blow pad. Again, my cotton ball is really sticky, so they're all a little stuck to it. Yeah, you want to carefully tap out all the flies you can, and you really want to make sure you're getting all of the adults that were in that vial, because you don't want to miss any data. Uh, and then you're going to grab one of these, the bent scupulas, and using the edge of the paintbrush, just kind of carefully brush them all to the edge of the flow pad. Again, making sure that you don't lose any adults or squish any of them beyond recognition. Then I'm going to be putting them into these uh, 1.5 ml tubes. There's a whole box of them in the drawer in the island. So you just want to make sure that you have your tube close to hand, because as soon as you take them off the flow pad, they're going to start waking up. So you want to kind of quickly, but carefully, brush them onto the scupula so that you have a whole line of them along it. And then place it into the vial and just angle it up. And they should all slide into the vial and you can cap it up. Uh, you want to do that really quickly because they'll start to wake up almost instantly. Uh, you can see they're already awake and moving in here. And then once you've got them in, you just want to carefully label the vial, making sure that you don't miss any important information and you've put enough information on the vial that you'll be able to know exactly what these flies are. So I've got on my vial the treatment, the generation of the flies, and the date that I collected them on. And then I'm going to take one of these white cardboard freezer boxes and just put all of my vials in here. And then I'm going to put this whole box into the negative 80 once I've collected all my flies.